Hello everybody, Strawberry Eli Beast here, and today I'm going to be talking to you about how Wuthering Waves runs on an iPad 9th generation. So to begin, I'm going to talk about probably the biggest issue I've experienced with playing this game, and that is the crashing. Please do not install this game on an iPad and expect that you are going to be able to play it for 3 to 4 hours on end. Because, spoiler alert, you're not. You are going to get max 10 to 30 minutes of game time depending on what you're doing before it hair crashes. Uh, for example, I could not do an entire section of one of the story quests because the game was heavy combat and completely hair crashed whenever I would try to do it. Uh, so much so to the point that I had to employ Chris to do that section for me. Now, I was lucky in that I did have Chris to do that section for me, but if you're someone who only has one device and no friends that could complete the section for you, then you are really just at a standstill. You are not going to be able to progress in the game. And that sucks. That's a real issue that the devs need to handle. And they have said that they're going to handle the issue and they're going to fix it. But to when they're going to do that, that has not been announced yet. And that's really awful because the gr the issue with the crashing really ties into my opinion on the ease of play. It makes the ease of play really difficult because if you were trying to uh, complete a story quest, if you're trying to gather materials, uh, level your characters, honestly, if you're just trying to do anything in the game, um, you have to do it really quickly before the game just stalls on you and you get sent back uh, to like where you began the story quests or any of the quests or you lose out on wishes and uh, materials and it, it's, it's just a really awful issue that I really do hope they handle soon because it's really altered um my opinion of the game which is really bad because i love the story i love the characters i love the graphics i think it's all beautiful really well done but when you have an issue as big as crashing every couple of minutes that honestly makes me say the game is not really worth playing unless you have a gaming pc or a really high advanced device that you can play it on if you're just going to play it on your iphone your ipad um, any apple products i would say i um if i'm wrong here please let me know but any apple products you are not going to be able to play the game as efficiently as you would like uh and i'm a gacha gamer i've played genshin for two to three years now and i've never experienced this issue with genshin i've been able to sit down and play genshin for three to four hours at a time and experience a little to no crashing. Uh, so it definitely is a Wuthering Waves issue. Uh, and once they do get that issue sorted, I will 100% go ahead and endorse playing this game because it is truly an amazing game. It is probably one of my favorite games that has come out this year, if not my favorite. Um, it just really sucks that the issue of uh, hair crashing is so bad. Uh, because when it comes to graphics, for example, I cannot play with the graphics any higher than the low setting, which is really annoying because the graphics are so beautiful and I've seen um, how they look on medium and that is so beautiful and I can only imagine how gorgeous they would look on the highest setting. Um, so I'm, yeah, it's just, it's really disappointing because I I went into this game with such with such high hopes, having come from like Genshin and Honkai Star Rail and all these games. I went in with Wuthering Waves with such high hopes, and then to see that my game was just crashing within a couple of minutes, it was really awful. Um, the last thing to note about the crashing issue is that it will prevent you from doing co-op. Co-op is not not permissible um, with the issue of hair crashing. Uh, me and Chris tried to do it yesterday and it was something that we had been working towards and we were really excited to do it and then we uh, entered each other's worlds and we went to fight a boss and within I'd say maybe 10 seconds of uh, me pressing start my game completely hair crashed and Chris was left there with the healer with doing absolutely no damage 
and it was a really awful awful experience so if you were thinking about doing co-op with your friends i'm so sorry to tell you that it's probably not going to be possible if you are thinking about fighting enemies or bosses together um and it's the crashing problem is going to make that really difficult um so yeah all in all the biggest issue with this game is crashing um and if you have another device to play on i really suggest that you use that over the ipad but if your ipad is your only um device i and you haven't downloaded the game yet and you're thinking about it um my honest advice to you would be if you think you can handle the hair crashing issue and that's not going to really be a problem, it's not going to get you too annoyed, it's not going to alter your experience of playing, then I would say go ahead, download it. 100% Wuthering Waves is a great game. But if the hair crashing issue is going to um, be a problem for you and you're not going to enjoy it and you're going to be like, oh, this is so annoying, I hate this, then I would say please hold off on downloading the game until the devs fix the optimization issues so you can get the max experience out of the game because you will truly love the game if you're a person who loves Genshin who loves Honkai who loves all these gotcha games you are really going to love Wuthering Waves so please 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 wait for them to fix this issue uh if you've not downloaded it already and if you have downloaded it already and you're like huh am I the only one experiencing these issues you're not you're really not I'm in the same boat as you guys I sit here uh, every day and I watch Chris play on his gaming laptop and I'm just like damn like I wish that could be me like he's collecting all the bosses he's collecting sorry, collecting all the echoes fighting all the bosses and I'm just here like running around in my little area and I, I go to click to fight a boss and then air crash complete hair crash uh, so it sucks watching your friends um, be able to progress in the game and sit down for hours and play it and you're just there and you're like oh i just want to catch this one echo but every time i try to do it the game crashes um so yeah so guys that's all i really have to say about uh how it runs uh i hope that this was insight for you and if you are thinking about downloading the game that you now know what to expect when you do it and if you have downloaded the game and we're wondering how does it run for other people you now have some insight into that too um all in all wuthering waves brilliant game fabulous game i really do enjoy playing it despite the issues that i have faced um so it really really is a good game and i truly encourage anybody who has the means to play it to play it because you will not be disappointed <laughs> this has been strawberry eli beast and i hope to see you all again next time